welcome to elliot wave analysis and forex forecast my name is muhammad azim and i am a certified elliot wave analyst this video is brought to you by readyforex.com risk disclaimer press the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to never miss upcoming videos Today is Wednesday, February 7th, 2024. I am going to analyze USDJPY currency pair. Let us start the top to bottom Elliott wave analysis. Inside daily time frame, the trend is down in USDJN currency pair. Daily time frame resistance is present at 151.90 price level. Price action is most likely going to rise up more and then drop to print bearish wave C corrective leg in coming trading days. A decisive bullish breakout above 151.90 resistance area is going to end down trend in daily chart of USD JPY currency pair. Next, let us take a look at 4 hour time frame. Price action manages to break below the most recent swing low. To me, USD JPY pair trend looks sideways in 4 hour time frame. Next, let us take a look at 1 hour time frame. The trend is up in 1 hour chart. Intraday support is present at 146.79 price level. Price action is most likely going to rise up to print bullish wave 5 impulse leg which offers a chance to join an uptrend in USD Yen pair. A decisive bearish break below 146.79 support level is going to end up trend in one hour chart of United States dollar versus Japanese Yen currency pair. To be more specific, the green color highlighted area offers a buying opportunity which is the previous fourth wave of one lesser degree. Do not jump into the market with a buy trade. Wait for a bullish breakout first. Take note, you must always trade with money management rules to control risk. Hello traders, today is Monday, February 5th, 2024. I am looking for a possible sell trade in GPUSD currency pair. Let me right click over here, go to trading, new order, and I'm going to place a pending order, a sell limit at 1.2613. Okay, I've placed my sell limit right over here. It's a pending order, meaning I am not inside the market. Let me move this one up a little bit. So hopefully market is going to rise up to fill my pending sell limit order. I am now going to place my stop loss and take profit level. So let me right click over here, go to modify. And this is going to be my stop loss. right around over here and regarding the take profit level the take profit level is going to be all the way down over here let me zoom out a little bit modify okay so i have placed my sell limit pending order stop loss and take profit level now what I'm going to do is I am going to open one trade, go to trading, new order, and I'm going to open one trade because I don't want to miss the trading opportunity. It is such a good trading chance at the moment. Okay, and let me also place this stop loss. Stop loss is going to be 1.27710. And the take profit level is going to be 1.24980. Okay, so I am now inside the market with one of my trading position. And for the other, the pending order, I'm waiting for the market to rise up a little bit more to fill my sell limit pending order. I took a sell trade with 0 0.10, one mini lot. Okay, and another one again with one mini lot this is an 11,000 US dollar live trading account so basically I divided position size into two parts or two stage entry so let me go over to four hour time frame so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to give this market some time so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the recording of my computer screen and I will come back as soon as the trade develops I am back now after a few minutes time GPUSD currency pair moved up let me also lower down my stop loss all the way over here 
I actually opened two trades one at the market and one with a pending order both sell entry orders are currently filled and I am inside the market my first sell at 1.2606 and second sell at 1.2613 in GP USD currency pair at the right hand side bottom corner you can see the PNL the profit and loss right now pound dollar is trying to rise up a little bit let me write it down the stop loss sell and take profit levels what i'm going to do now is i'm going to pause the recording of my computer screen and i will come back as soon as the trade develops i am back now after a few hours time and today is monday february 5th 2024 currently price action in gpusd currency pair is falling down and i am in profit if you check out the right hand side bottom corner you see my PNL which is the profit and loss this is an 11,000 US dollar trading account and I have taken two sell trading positions in GP USD currency pair one trading position at 1.2613 and second one at 1.2606 both trading positions are currently in profit I am now going to pause the recording of my computer screen and I will come back as soon as the trade develops I am back now after a few hours time and today is Monday February 5th 2024 currently GP USD currency pair is falling down to my take profit level I took two trades separately in GPUSD currency pair and I have already closed one trade with profit second trade is still running what I am going to do now is I am looking to close the trade just double click over here and once I hit the close sell button then it will automatically close my trade at the right hand side bottom corner you can see the PNL the profit and loss and I have already closed one trade with 53 pips profit okay so I am now going to close my second trade so let me hit the close button trade is now closed let me go over to the trading account history so I managed to close one trade with 86 pips and second trade with 53 pips overall I made 138 US dollar profit for those who are interested to check out some of my past trades go to my website readyforex.com click on trading with Elliott wave scroll it down and you can see some of my past trades over here if you have any questions feel free to contact me for more forex trading information visit readyforex.com